And then I was like, oh, I should do a vlog today. That's great, because like that doesn't take planning. So every year, nothing's open on Christmas Day. And every year I'm surprised by this. Yo, I just want some bread. I'm hungry, dog. Let's see what I can get. I'm at Safeway and let's see how easy it is to be vegan on Christmas Day when you don't have any food at home. And I'll show you guys. Yesterday I started craving Swedish fish and ginger snap cookies and they're both vegan. So I'm gonna see if they have them here. Yeah, I'm not gonna worry about the sugar and oil today, but tomorrow, well, if the food's left over, I'm gonna have to eat it till it's gone and then. I have vegan bread, guys. This brand, well at least, I don't know if all of their breads are vegan. I know this brand, I've eaten them before, so we're in luck. They don't seem to have this small roasted red pepper. I don't need that much. I'm gonna be eating it for like days. So, I don't know. It's tricky though trying the other kind because I haven't tried this kind, but I've tried other kinds and I didn't like them that much, so. I'm about to leave this store without getting sparkling cider. It's the holidays. What was I thinking? I got everything I wanted and more. I actually put a couple things back because I was doing the most. I think I'm gonna go have a picnic at the beach because it's Christmas and I'm by myself and why not? It's beautiful, it's like 80 degrees and I'm trying to decide which beach to go to. Kahala is an easy choice because it's usually pretty uh, empty. Waikiki I thought about but it's gonna be super crowded and I was also thinking Makapu'u, which is a drive. It's probably gonna be like a 30 minute drive. Like, I don't know how much, how long my battery's gonna last and I didn't bring my camera camera, so we'll see. I might have to start there and then do a mukbang at home or something. I slept until 11 today and then I Skyped with my mom and my sister and her kids. Okay, now go. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Good job. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Merry Christmas. So I really want to be outside right now and eat all the yummy food I got. And I, ooh, I didn't get water. Oh. I have a few hours till the sun goes down. So I'm gonna go home, get some water, get my camera, camera. When I say camera, camera, I mean my DSLR, not my phone. So this video is gonna be a mixture of phone video and DSLR video because that's just my life. I need to get a vlogging camera, but I'm gonna go home and get that and we're gonna to go to Makapu. Can okay, y'all see that rainbow? It's like this every day here. Every day there's a rainbow. All right, let me drive. All right, so I forgot to check the weather and it looks like it might rain. This is my vegan Safeway haul. I did get the organic Blue corn tortilla chips by Sabra. It's the roasted red pepper. I was gonna get pretzels, they're really good with those too, but I decided like I don't wanna spend $100 today. <laughs> this is gonna last, you know, for a few days at least. Ginger snap cookies, these are so good, and they are vegan. I used to like eat them every day when I was in college, and then I got sick of them. Apples and dates. I got a whole bag of these apples. It's like a bag about like this size. That means nothing to you, I'm sure. Apples and dates together taste like caramel apples. It's so good. So if you like caramel apples and you want something healthy, I decided to get this organic Martinelli's. I get the regular kind all the time. I'm curious. I wonder if this tastes any better or if it's a gimmick. I'm actually afraid to open it now because it's been shaken up in my car on Thanksgiving. I 
opened a bottle at home and it sprayed all over the walls and the ceilings and my computer and my keyboard and everything because it had been shaken up. And these are hard. You know with like a soda can, you can kind of open it slowly and then let the carbonation kind of fizz out so that it doesn't spray everywhere. With this, you can try to open it slowly but it's still going to spray out. So if it's been shaken up, I recommend don't open it right away. I also got two bags of raisins but those I use for my oatmeal in the morning. Those were two for six dollars at Safeway. And they're just raisins, that's it. There's nothing else added to them. I put them in my oatmeal with almond milk and it's perfect. So all together that was 60 bucks. But again, this is gonna last me, well, okay. This will last a normal person probably like a week. Oh, I also got English muffins. They're like accidentally vegan. It didn't say vegan on them. And that I got for the spaghetti squash. I like scraped the spaghetti squash. We made pizza. And so that was one of the toppings. He mixed that together with the, some of the sauce that was left over. I'm gonna make like little sloppy joe <laughs> type sandwiches with that. This isn't stuff that like you have to, I mean this is junk. So you don't really have to spend a ton of money but keep in mind like these dates are gonna last a long time. I'll have probably like a couple apples a day with these with like a few dates and that'll last a while and the the cider you have to drink right away pretty much. well actually you can reseal it like I wanted to set up on the beach over there and I don't know that this is the right beach to do that I should have checked the weather but then on my way here I was like oh it's sunny it's beautiful it's gonna be fine and then right when I got here it's like dun 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 I have, you know, but living, I'd have to figure something out. But also where I was. 